Okay, so today I'm going to bake a blueberry uh, loaf. Us in England would call it cake, but over here they call it bread. I'm not sure why it's called bread because it's really quite sweet. However, um, that's it. It's it's a it's a blueberry loaf or blueberry piece of cake, whatever you want. But it's very very tasty. Now. I'm not using regular white flour. Um, I have taken a picture of the flours that I'm using, but it's essentially almond flour, coconut flour, uh, and I have a nut flour blend that I just kind of tossed in here. But in addition to that, uh, because I work out, uh, I've put a, you know, about three scoops of protein powder. In it which is going to make it very very dense but you know i do have a sweet tooth and i really have been craving something sweet and i just won't buy it in the stores anymore but this really satiates my sweet tooth and um i have you know, about a handful full of blueberries uh this is a little less than a cup of coconut sugar uh i have five eggs in here a little bit of apple sauce and I've squeezed all oh, about three or four tablespoons of honey in here. So that will kind of offset what, I, you know, make up for the little less than cup of sugar. And then I have about uh, a quarter of a cup of, you know, whatever butter you use. I use kind of like this vegan substitute thing. Uh, it's just like butter. And um, I have some coconut milk it's kind of thick it was in the fridge it's coconut milk um the recipe sometimes people use sour cream and, or whipped cream or something i don't use that so uh, this is all uh, vegan and if you notice here i've got these tiny little loaves let's have a look because i haven't been using my oven i've been using an air fryer uh, to do everything and i haven't been using my oven so i put it in here because obviously uh the big loaf pan doesn't fit okay so there's that and uh we do need some baking powder which i didn't take out so let me go and get some of that i've got some somewhere here we are i'll put a little bit of baking soda in there and then i'll also put a little bit of baking powder you know, baking soda is good for all kinds of things. I put it in my laundry. You know, I work out, so I've got all that workout stuff. So uh, I put a teaspoon of that. And then I'm going to put a teaspoon. I've got to go in the cupboard I've left you. See all the sound effects. And I'm going to put some baking powder in there as well. So you put about you know a spoon or so i kind of eyeball it you can't really go too wrong it only makes it rise so i'm gonna put that in there as well and um a pinch of salt just a pinch just a pinch and i use sea salt it's all relative if you ask me let's put a pinch there you go and that's that it's really quite easy it's not hard at all you know if you have a sweet tooth and you can have these things and not feel you like having a guilty pleasure you know what i mean and so i'm going to take my blender my hand blender i've had this thing for ages you know and i'm just going to whip the wet stuff together Add the sugar. Oops. A bit untidy there. You know, my kitchen's quite small. So. Whip that all together. Really, really nice. going to be 
that for a moment. Let's turn stirring baking soda, baking powder into the flour. You know, if you want to put a little bit of nutmeg in there, you can, you know. Um, I don't think I will today, but I've done that in the past. Nutmeg, cinnamon, that sort of thing, if you like. I'm not going to do that today, though. This thing, this is so good, you know. I eat this thing when I bake it. And um, now I'm going to pour this in. the bowl with the dried stuff. Let's see, the sugar hasn't quite melted. There you go. And I'm going to stir this as well. Just do it nice and slow. everything else in there that's where we're going to put our margarine or butter or whatever it is we use and then we're going to put our coconut cream in there that should make it nice and moist Um, add the blueberries and just kind of fold them in. Just fold them in. And I actually like quite a few blueberries. I'll put a handful, handful and a half, you know, whatever you like. You know, the good thing about cooking and baking and stuff like that, you follow a basic recipe and then you just kind of make it your own. Now, this might be too much for my three little loaf pans there so uh, I've got some more in the house and I'll just do that I'll just put them in there and just kind of pour it in you don't put it all the way up to the top because you know you don't want it to kind of overflow I pour it in I'll give my daughter one enough for another pan and I'm gonna put this in the air fryer on roast for about I don't know 13 minutes or so because it'll do it real quick and there you go there you have it and I'll show you what it's like at the end now they look a little bit dark and you could probably think from that that they're a little bit burnt now this one was the first one I did and I've, I haven't done any kind of loaves in the air fryer yet until these and I, I so I think this one might have gotten a little bit too done on the side so what I did was is I 
adjusted the temperature and the time for the second one and the second one um, it looks much better um, again remember I use coconut sh coconut um, raw coconut sugar and the, and the coconut sugar is very very dark so um, this one I think has baked much better um, I think this one might be slightly overdone at the sides but this one I think will be will be much better and um, I shall let you all know how they taste uh, once they cool down but they look they look delish I'm actually looking forward to uh, partaking of this with some ice cream uh, I'll keep you posted so this is the end result right and I just had to share it with you guys because look how moist that looks and this and i had a piece i had a piece because I, I needed to just test it right but the moisture is just delectable it's absolutely scrumptious look at that Re oh and it tastes the, the the level of sweetness is perfect because like i said i used a bit of honey and some coconut sugar and it wasn't burnt at all i mean just look don't really need anything with it you know but guess what i'm gonna put some of that on it yes i am and you see that sweet tooth i was talking about it's just gonna have to quell Happy Sunday evening, people. Blueberry loaf. Up in here, up in here.